13 News Now at 11 begins with a look at the northern lights as seen from Hampton Roads. If you kept your eye to the sky tonight, you may have been able to see the Aurora Borealis. These photos were taken in Virginia Beach. You know, the phenomenon isn't usually visible this far south. And Hampton Roads isn't the only place in Virginia able to see it either tonight. Here's another incredible picture of the lights from Broadnax, just west of Emporia. Thanks for staying up tonight. I'm Dan Kennedy, joined by meteorologist Evan Stewart. Evan, turned out to be the perfect night to see this. Yeah, it really did. We had clear skies. We had that strong geomagnetic storm that uh, formed earlier today. Now, if you're expecting to go out and see these bright greens that are showing right here, these are usually reserved for far northern latitudes up into Canada. They're just too low in the atmosphere to see here because of the curvature of the Earth. But we were able to see some of those reds and some of those pink colors because of that strong geomagnetic storm. We were up to a level eight storm, a K8. That's pretty high, something we haven't seen in several months. It was back, I think, on May 10th that we saw an equal storm like this. If you were hoping to see them, a lot of times you can't see them really with the naked eye. You can really see them certainly with the cameras, and you have to get away from lights. This is a satellite view showing the lights of all the cities, and a lot of the pictures, some of them did come from the metro area, but a lot of the pictures were really best uh, coming from areas where we were not seeing a lot of light pollution. And you have to go out there and let your eyes adjust. Best in complete darkness away from the light pollution of the cities. So that's why a lot of the pictures did come from North Carolina up through the Middle Peninsula and the Eastern Shore, and those those cameras were on the enhanced night mode. 